guest today. Uh, NHS student-led tutorials. This is a segment about the new student-led tutorials run by NHS students. How to have comparing your bad grades with other students? Embarrassed of getting a zero on a test that everyone else got a 12 on? Have a test this Wednesday but left it off for Tuesday? NHS has a solution for you. Go to room 222 every Tuesday from 3.30 to 4.30 for help in English, math, and science to never get a bad grade again. Next up is how to make a TV feed video. In this segment, you'll find out how to make interesting videos even if you ran out of inspiration. TVP can be an exhausting course, especially now that we actually need to use some creativity. So if you're ever looking for an easy 12, just pick production. The only condition to get actual high grades is to get as many angles as possible. And remember, once you've used every single angle as many times as you possibly could, just get random close-ups. It's not like that actually matters. And if you ever worry about the green screen, worst comes to worst, just put something random in the background and hope it works. Because no one actually pays attention to anything but the actual host. If production is in your style, there's always tech. The only skill required for tech is panning shots and random close-ups. You'll also need lots, and I mean lots, of keyboard sounds. And for voiceovers, just say a bunch of numbers. 13 inch edition. Weighs 3 pounds. 0.7 inches. 1440 by 900 pixels. An Intel Core i5 535OU. 8 gigabytes of RAM. 120 gigabytes total. Haven't reached 2 minutes yet? Don't worry. You can always just sprinkle in a few over the shoulder shots. Put whatever you want on the screen. It's alright. People will be too amazed by your epic camera work to even notice what's on the screen anyways. And boom! Using the art of bullcrapping, you successfully filmed a tech video. If all the other topics are filled and you end up getting stuck with the how-to video, don't sweat it. Just go through these six simple steps. Step one, brainstorm ideas. Step two, realize you have no creative ideas whatsoever. Step three, cry. Step four, contemplate whether you should drop the class or not. Step five, realize it's too late. Step six, come up with a meta idea that will allow you to include all the shots you need without leaving the comfort of the classroom. Oh, and don't forget the outro. My name is Lena Hassan, along with my partner Annika, reporting for ACS Today. And there you have it. If all goes to plan, your final TVP video should look something like this. In the next segment, we have Zach. My segment's about the story of a girl addicted to cyberbullying and the length she'll go to to seek attention and revenge. segment. In this, Will and Leo interview people about new ACS uniforms. The ACS uniform comes from the Lands and Supplier and has a wide variety of casual and semi-formal tops with the ACS logo embroidered on it. They also include two colorways of sports shorts and tops. Students are allowed to wear black or khaki shorts or long pants. because it's really easy in the morning. I don't like them as they don't show a uniqueness to every person in the school as everyone has, may have different styles. Um, I don't like the lack of variety. I feel like most times people wear the same thing every day and it doesn't really let you express who you are through your clothing. I like how you could uh, wear any sneaker you want. As long as the students' shoes are compliant with the dress code, they are allowed to wear anything they want. So I really like that it's actual good quality, it's comfortable, and then you have like a, a variety of choices 
for the actual material. So let's say you don't really like um, the breathable ones, so you can get like the fully cotton ones. And then you have like different colors. You get gray, black, white, and green. So you you always have like a choice in what you want to wear. Honestly, I think it's a little too expensive um, because if you look at the quality of the t-shirts, for example, I would say that it w should have cost a little less. The issue, however, is that the opinions on the uniform are very mixed. Some students are very fond of the uniforms, enjoying the quality and design, while others are unhappy with the variety and price. This problem will not have a solution that will make everyone happy, but the ACS admin is always striving to listen to everyone's opinions and are always striving to improve the uniforms at ACS. I'm William Askolt, along with Leo Mania, reporting for ACS Today at the American Community School of Abu Dhabi. In this segment, Jad and Abdullah will humorously make an advertisement for a budget phone. The X Touch. Crafted to perfection. Innovative audio. But can it break? Hammers. Blow after blow. Power drill. Power saw. The X Touch, built for survival. I'm Jad. And I'm Abdullah. Reporting for ACS Today at the American Community School of Abu Dhabi. <laughs>